All right, so for today's workout, we're gonna go strong man style. So we're gonna be working some heavy carries and then we're gonna be doing some change of direction athletic work today. So we're gonna go 40 seconds of work with a 20 second break and we're gonna go for three rounds. So it's a little bit longer duration. So we're gonna go with that Zercher carry. So again, Zercher position, you should be in the crooks of your arms, you're hugging that uh, bell nice and close. And I just want you to walk with it. You can march in place if you need to, but we're just walking, keeping tension in the core. We're not leaning back, we're not resting into our low back. We're keeping that core braced, okay? Keeping the squeeze on the kettlebell, and we're just gonna walk around um, for that 40 seconds, okay? If that bothers you with the low back, just go in the rack position. Make it a little more simpler if you need to. So hit that rack position if you have any low back stuff going on, okay? Once you're done with that, you have a 20 second break, then we have lateral shuffles. So again, two count, just back and forth, okay? If you don't have space for the lateral shuffles, what I want you guys to do is just run in place for that 40 seconds, okay? Once you're done with that, we're gonna go ahead and grab a bench. We have step ups. Now, I recommend the rack position, but you can have it down in the suitcase. Whatever kettlebell position feels best for you, okay? So, um, it's always gonna be same side. So, if the kettlebell's on my left side, my left leg's gonna go on the bench, I'm gonna step, and I'm gonna control down, slight lean forward, as you lower down, okay? Once you hit that 20 second mark, just hit the other side, okay? And then once we're done with that, we're gonna finish off with skaters. So again, just back and forth from here. Almost like you're trying to hop over something. You wanna go max distance on each leap across for that 40 seconds, okay? And then we're gonna go for three rounds. 